Hey guys, this is Ben, and I'm sure I look absolutely dreadful. I never prepare myself for before I start filming proper live action segments. Um, first of all, hi. It's been a very long time since I last posted anything on this channel. I'm not dead, so there you go. Um, I've just been taking a very long break because I've got a lot going on now. I've got work, I've got my personal life. Basically, my life is not the same as... It I think I just heard a dog barking outside, sorry about that. Um, I think it's safe to say that my life has changed since I started YouTube. You know, nothing stays the same forever. Um, my life now is not the same as it was eight years ago when I started YouTube. Uh, since then, I've finished education, I've got a job, I've got responsibilities now. I'm an adult, I'm not a kid anymore. Um, so because of that, I just don't have time for YouTube as much as I used to, but... Today is a special occasion. It's my eight year anniversary since I started YouTube. 30th of May 2011 was when I posted my first video and here we are eight years later and I thought it might be fun to try something different. I'm going to react to my first ever video. The first one I ever posted. The one that started it all. Let's Let's see how it turns out. I don't remember the vast majority of what's in that video. There's a lot of stuff I've forgotten, so I might cringe to death. I don't know. I I don't really know what I'm in for. I've forgotten all of it. But it might be fun. So here it is. My reaction to my first YouTube video ever. Okay, here we go. Hello, fellow YouTubers. My name is BennyPing64, but you probably already knew that. And, and that intro right there, I don't know why I didn't use that more often, that hello fellow YouTubers. I think that was an intro that I was considering using, and I just never used it again. I don't know why, it would have been a half decent one. And the camera quality is absolutely dreadful. All of this was filmed on a camera, not even a good quality one. And you can actually see it reflected a couple of times in the screen right there. A horde of zombies! <laughs> That's right. we have to oh my god That's terrible do we have in our Okay Why I give this kid course. an A for effort But my god system, Practice first okay. Get five someone zombies. else to do it Like he, wow. I'm pretty sure I was going through puberty at the time. After my I was still going through bodily changes yeah, So man, voice cracks like that Wasn't uncommon at the time Rather than shotguns or chainsaws We have these things uh, these things are commonly known as pea shooters, but you'll probably already know that if you've played this game before. Now, right off the and bat, of I can tell it. that well, first of all, this was long before I had any real experience second, with talking to well, people. I'm not even talking to people, I'm talking to a camera. And like it it's, it's very obvious that I was new to this. A horde of zombies you can tell by my voice right. just how well, um, inexperienced really, I am. It's really an addicting game, and it's a lot of fun. Wow, that was really funny. What? If I had two peas, but they were so close together, it only looked like one. Wow, okay, right. Anyway, uh, if you don't I think I already ran out of stuff to talk yes, about. See, you can always get I think I've said this before. I think I might have said this in the actual or, Let's Play. Plants vs. Zombies was not a good Let's Play to start with. I should have saved this for when I was much more experienced with commentary, because the thing is, I kept running out of things to talk about. Plants vs. Zombies okay. is a difficult so game to commentate over really because plant, the gameplay is just the same stuff over and over again. So because of that, plants, like, okay, you know, it gets repetitive. Commentary is difficult. Or you got, like, 11 on the playing board. Okay, so now I've got more lawn. And, um, yeah, I think I can squeeze about three levels into this because... That level went by just a bit too quickly. Yeah, of course, I keep forgetting this was in 2011. This was before, like, having more than 15 minutes of um, video time was actually, like, you know, common. But back in the day, you had to earn the right to upload a video that was longer than 15 minutes. So there were a couple of occasions where I had to split um, videos up. Yeah, th th that brings back memories. Those were the old days of YouTube. It's changed now. You can upload a friggin' two-hour video now. I have uh, not used two coms before, and I've regretted it. Uh, most people will advise that you plant as many sunflowers as you can. Oh, that zombie's lost his head. 
Well, what? that must have sounded really weird. It did sound it's really weird, you freaking idiot. I'm probably not going to be very good at this unless I get some practice in. Wow, okay. But anyway, um, there's a pea shooter on every lane. This... My younger self has no oh, idea on, what to talk about. He's trying. He's trying desperately yes, to come up with entertaining stuff. Really slow, by friggin', I don't even know what I'd call that. He saw an opportunity to do some kind of weird, uh, some kind of weird cartoon a, voice. Helmet, I don't know if that's a reference to something. To be I mean, do, everything I've ever said is a reference, pretty much. So it's probably a reference to a movie or something, and I've just forgotten it in vehicles and trust me um, the vehicles on these are quite uh, hard to take down uh, gonna want to plant another pea shooter there just to mow that guy down well uh, actually um, now you do have this line of defense but uh, when a horde of zombies comes on and there's too many for you to handle well, sometimes the zombies can get through an entire... Right, game. okay. Those things behind the I'm trying to explain the game mechanics. So but again, this is all stuff that I'm new to, so I'm kind of just stumbling over my words a little bit. But there's the so much umming and ahhing, and to be honest, I think I still do that on occasion, just because, like, when you put me in front of a camera or whatever, I can talk for hours. All the zombies... But this was before I actually mastered the art of commentary, so it's just plastered with friggin' pauses and stutters. Okay, cherry bomb. Now, I am not going to lie, this plant kicks ass. All swearing, good job, boy. Yeah, this is a this is a, an adult channel. He's he crammed a couple of swears in there. Plant. Yeah, I really should have yelled out, ready, set as well. Oh my god. Plant out loud. Yeah, of course it does. Why did you do it? Yeah, those cone hats are actually very durable. They make really good armor for a zombie. In fact, if one of the zombies gets a bit too close for comfort, I think that I might run outside and what? go grab myself a cone hat. What the hell are you talking about? Just so uh, I can protect myself. For what? a few minutes. Wait, hang on. Am I talking about what would happen in an zombie actual zombie away. apocalypse? To get to my delicious brains. What? Uh, Did I you just say zombies. that? Unless the police have turned to zombies. Too. Oh my god. I'm just wondering, how many zombies are there in this game? Because it's only... Uh, Right, okay, okay, immediately I've run out of stuff to talk about, so I'm just trying to think of ways to keep it entertaining, so right there I'm just pondering, ooh, what would actually happen in a real zombie apocalypse? Let's actually use cone hats and see if they're as good as they look. Just see if they actually do anything at all. So, just imagine someone had no life whatsoever, and they actually decided to add up how many zombies were in the game? Now that is actually a good question. How many zombies are in the whole game? In fact, I don't even know if it's a set number. Maybe it's maybe it's randomly generated. Yes. No one cares enough to ask that question. That would be the most boring episode of Game Theory ever. It's literally just counting up and up and up. Of course, the zombies are quite smart, despite being dead, and they will be coming out with lots more armor. They're going to be coming out with buckets, which are extremely durable, and much more stuff. But we'll get into that. So much stuff that you could only think of one example. Okay, we're getting pretty close to defeating all the zombies. And to be honest, looking back at this, I don't know why I kept focus on the top screen for so long, because... I think it was episode 13 or 14, something like that. I only focused on the bottom screen. Like, I should have done that much sooner, because only on occasion do you actually have to film the top screen. Most... What the... What noise was that? Was that me considering what to do? I was making a choice, and I did sort of a... Like a fucking... Oh, I just swore. Sorry about that. No, I'm keeping that in, who cares? Uh, just like a bloody just creaking door sound. I watch a lot of zombie movies, so it's hard for me to interpret wow, okay. what okay. caused the apocalypse or what caused zombies Okay, the, this was this was definitely so maybe you guys um, before I b before so I got my adult voice, let's call it. Wow, well, you can tell I was going through bodily changes. This was when I was still I in school. Who Everyone loves scary movies. 
But um, so I completely forgot what I was saying. Why are you leaving the comments? Oh, Christ, I can't why remember what I was saying. Like oh, comment questions. Oh, that died out so easily. I had no idea, like, to how to fill out quick. the runtime. Uh, so I just came up with these stupid okay, comment questions. Old. And some of them are just, like, I, I don't know. I was, I was really clutching at straws, Wait. just trying to think of something oh, decently I entertaining. Did I? Oh, no, I remember oh. now what I was saying before. I kept okay, so no, much no, focus no, on the top screen. No, I, I should have only shown it for the first episode, because you never need to film it. Only, only like, 5% of the time, I should have kept it on the bottom screen more often than not. So the quality in these videos is dreadful. functions as wall and blocks off other zombies. But... I'll have to use that in the next level as well, but trust me, there will be a cherry bomb in the next level, so you guys can look forward to that. So, see you guys then. See you guys then. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that I accidentally ripped that off of uh, Chugga Conroy. Um, this was before I decided on an outro as well, so, well, that's actually kind of weird to look back on. Well, there you go. That's me reacting to my first video. I know that that's not really a lot of content. It's only a nine minute video. And um, I don't know. I, I just kind of wanted to do this for an experiment more than anything else. I wanted to do this just to see how it would feel to go back to a video that I haven't seen in years just to see how much I've changed. Um, one thing's for certain. I had no confidence back then. You can tell, you can tell that I was very new to that whole commentary thing, so, yeah. That's a little weird to look back on. When you compare that video to my more recent ones, like, in recent videos, I can bunny on for hours and hours. In that video, like, it's very obvious that I wasn't comfortable talking even into a camera. Like, if there were actual people in the room with me, you wouldn't hear a peep out of me. That's actually kind of weird to look back on. It's surreal. But, well, there you go. That's me reacting to my first video. Um, this is kind of an experimental video. Uh, just really just because I haven't posted anything for ages. I thought I might just give you guys something to watch. And it's my eight year anniversary at the time that I'm recording this. Well, actually, no, I'm recording it the day before. It's, it's going to be uploaded on my eight year anniversary. So, yeah, happy YouTube birthday to me. Eight years, that's amazing. That time has flown by incredibly fast. Um, hope you enjoyed. Peace out, YouTube.